Maybe I should turn on the microphone. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Car Christian here, Car Christian here, Neko Live Gaming. Back today, and I, this is the second time I actually recorded this because. Oh God. And this is actually the second time I've recorded this because my audio stuff were set wrong. So it were recording my internal, my output coming from my computer into the mixer. But not the signal from the mixer and out to the computer. So um, my microphone wasn't recorded. But anyway, we're back today with Nekopara. We're gonna start a new game. And I'm gonna fix the voice setting for you. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm heading out. <sighs> Phew, this should be most of the boxes then. I wiped the sweat off my forehead with my arm as the moving truck disappeared from the view. Although it was early April on the only the beginning of spring, today's weather was quite nice, it was even a bit hot. Well, it's a good day for a new start. I turned, turned my head to look at the empty bakery, which didn't even have a signage yet. The brand new exterior wall had a western look with a predominantly white and brown motif. Uh, there was also large windows which let lots of sunlight in. And finally, they were the words that displayed the name of the bakery, La Soleil. Instead of the proper French article, Le, it was La Soleil, meaning the sun. Uh, this was an odd tour was the name of the shop of someone I admired. Now that I'm on my own, I'll have to do my best. I softly murmured to myself. From here on out, no one would tell me what to do. I was going to start completely new. Despite the satyr of my family's name and everything I've that had happened to me up until now. I alone would decide my path and take responsibility for what what I do. In exchange for that freedom, I can can't blame anyone else for what happens and this basic regency. In my fucking microphone, that's better. Uh what happens? Still, although I was a bit worried, uh, the thought of what laid ahead of me made me break into a smile. All right, in any case, I'll better get all of these things cleaned up. I took a deep breath and got my spirits back up. I stepped into the new smiling bakery. And by the way, just to have that said, um... This series is going to be going on YouTube, but later in the other series of Nekopara, when we get more into Volume 1 and into Volume 2 and Volume 3 and all of that, uh, I'm going to be um, having previews, Safe for Work previews on the channel with a link going to a Patreon post, which is going to have the full uncensored, like, because I have the 18 plus DLC installed, so, <laughs> so that YouTube Sama won't. Uh, YouTube Chan won't blast off my butt cheeks for it. So, yeah. But anyhow, um, one dollar a month will give you access to those. Okay, sorry about that, people. <laughs> um, what's with this big box? In front of me was a large box I didn't recognize, or two, in fact. Fragile, delicate, absolutely this side up. If thrown, your company will be in trouble. The warnings were going overboard and never getting annoying. Even if these are bakery supplies, I don't remember buying them. Anything quite like this. Uh, first off, they were boxes that looked like they came from my house. And if these were bakery, were for the bakery, there's no way I wouldn't remember buying them. There were no tags from the moving company either. All there was were those warning labels. Well, I'll know for sure once I open that. Huh? Uh, 
Oh, he's just a cat. Uh, just some trouble, cool, troublesome cat. Jeez. As if that would fool me, what are you doing in there, Chocola? <laughs> well, we just saw each other yesterday at home, you know. Well, compared to the rest of my things for the bakery, you are heavy. And she ignored that, but sure. She just puffed her cheeks. You can say that she was always, always a happy-go-lucky cat girl. Or rather, she pre preoccupies herself with only what was in front of her. Well, I guess that's how you could describe Chocola. While I was getting ready to move, I did wonder why I didn't see you. <laughs> hey, Vanilla. Oops. Okay, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I went the wrong way. Okay, I'm just gonna do that for now. Hmm. Long time. Why wow, is vanilla here too? Wherever chocolate is, I am too. Besides, cat girl don't dislike tight spaces. Also, they said this box was heavy, so be careful with it in regards to me too. So I was also mad, just steaming. Again, huh? In any case, chocolate vanilla, get out of there. I was at my wrist end with these large boxes that had suddenly showed up. Anyhow, chocolate vanilla, get out of their boxes. Why is no one picking up the phone? Just what is she good at doing? I hung up after trying to call my little sister. There was no way that chocolate and vanilla could have gotten mixed in with the rest of the boxes in the first place. On the outside, cat girl looks almost like humans. They can understand words and can talk just like us. But more than humans, cat girl were closer to normal cats. After all, cat girls had ears and tails just like cats do. They were genetically modified humanoid cats that were commonly referred to as cat girls. These days, cat girls fit into our daily society as pets in families or partners to humans. My little sister really loves dote on cat girls, so our family has six, including chocolate and vanilla. In any case, that could have been mailed themselves. They couldn't have mailed themselves on their own. Mailing living things through the post would be impossible for one thing. There's no way my parents would have helped with this either in the second part. So thus, I only can guess that this was somehow Shigura's doing. I say so, Shigura was some compl a compliance here, then. ご主人の会社をバッチリ。バニラ、あっち、あっちの部屋行ってみよう。関係。don't get out of control and hurt yourselves! Without any ill intention, the two cat girls were off running. Well, 
The bakery did have living quarters on the second floor, so I wasn't worried about them causing a ruckus around here. Of course, they aren't run young cackers anymore, so I shouldn't have to worry about them getting out of control too much. Well, besides that, <laughs> I looked up in my address, uh, up an address in my phone address book. Mod Minaduki Residence. Well, I already left she got a message, so I she c should call me back later. Without pressing the call button, I put my cell phone back in my pocket. I had moved out without saying anything, so for her to call me back within the same day seemed a bit stupid. Baka. Uh, well, it wasn't really an issue I needed to bring up at this very moment. I should hear from Shigure soon anyhow. Well, hi there, Shokula. Good work, you two. Gosh, both of you are mastered bedheads. Jeez. <laughs> and hopefully that's a good thing. Motto. <laughs> oh, I'll give you more. <laughs> I tied up their hair with a comb. Their soft hair felt nice any uh, nice as always. I lightly bunking them both on the head while they had their eyes closed. Now then, why were you two off hide off hiding among my moving boxes? You had no choice, just tagged along you two. Well, I figured out that had to be the reason, but sure. Anyhow, I recompensed myself and looked on the two of them again. Listen up, okay? How many times have I tell uh, times have I told you two? This is a vacation or a picnic. I moved out because I have no intention of going back there. If you were at home, you wouldn't have to worry about anything. Shigure and the other characters are here too. It would be better off if you two just... Uh, where's my mouse, damn it. Okay, sorry about the quick ending there. Um, my storage space pretty much ran out, so I had a bit of HQ with that. But the thing that basically happened was that, well, well, Chocolonus got the uh, food basically, or it ended off. I were about to end the episode there anyway, but it was basically just me. Chocola coming with excuses because of her stomach rumbling and Vanilla thinking it was cute. Uh, basically, that was the entire thing that really happened uh, before I ended up the episode with saying Thanks for watching everybody stay tuned and stay awesome um, Of course, it's gonna be safe for work previews on YouTube and uh, Not safe for work entire full and can the whole entire schmack on patreon for one dollar a month so Thank you guys for watching stay tuned and stay awesome and Necrolive gaming out